G'day lawn care freaks, I'm Jason, welcome to Lush Cut Lawns. If you like these videos, leave me a comment, uh, give me a like, and also subscribe to the channel. I really, really appreciate it. Now, this was a random knock at the door about four weeks ago. You see the last video I did was actually the front lawn. So now we're here to do the side of the property, which you can see here is an absolute nightmare. There's grass everywhere, weeds. This is probably gonna take me two hours to do about probably 10 meters. Uh, worth of driveway because it's absolutely insane. Now, when I did the front lawn, I actually had a chat to her about for about an hour after I did the front lawn. It was so exciting finding out, you know, about someone that grew up in the, you know, 1930s and 1940s as a young teenage girl and how it actually different, how different it is today in 2022 than it was in 1930 and 1940. So, really good discussion and I'm absolutely stoked to be able to help her out. Also, what I'm gonna to do too, is I'm actually gonna show you the back of the backyard here of the property at the end of the video as well. So stick around for that because you're not gonna to wanna to miss part three, which is going to be this back lawn. You don't wanna miss that. Anyway, it's gonna be good. Let's get straight into it and let's get it done.
you know what? It's always amazing what you find in lawns. You don't see it until you either hit it or you reveal it with the uh, line trimmer or string trimmer. I'll show you this. So I had no idea it was there. Obviously it's only a tire, but that was all covered. Look, you just have no idea what's in there. Just goes to show you gotta be careful with your equipment, guys. You gotta be careful. <laughs> well, this is certainly a messy job brush cutting or string or line trimming, whatever you want to call it, whippersnipping here in Australia. Man, holy crap. Not a bad job so far, but anyway, we're going to get back into it, probably just start blowing it, start trying to reveal uh, these concrete uh, drive tracks, see how we go. <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm going to blade edge because you can see down here still really wet after a bit of uh, blowing and a bit of edging and brush cutting you can see concrete here which you really couldn't see before <laughs> now it's still pretty wet here so I might just grab the little utility mower just to go over it and then we'll see how we go
I wanted to show you guys something too with these uh, grasses that grow in between <laughs> these concrete cracks. They're an absolute nightmare. And even the, even the string trimmer is hard to get through. Let me show you. All right, so I kicked this one out. That one is, but uh, that one's come out a little bit, but surprisingly they come out when you kick them. There's here as well, all along here, you know, they're coming out there kicking, but the string, the string trimmer just won't take them out. Anyway. That's what happens, eh, when you got the and when you've let it go for, I don't know, probably two to three years without doing it. Alright guys, I wanted to show you this grass, um, this is kaikuyu, well, this is weed actually, but this stuff here is kaikuyu, as you can see, the big long runners, it just keeps standing up, so there's not much you can do. Yeah, a lot of people don't like uh, kaikuyu grass, because it just turns into like spaghetti when it gets real long, but uh, anyway, it's no match for lush cut lawns. <laughs> Now, I also want to show you something. I was going to blade edge, but check this out. Every time I use the uh, string trimmer, it just fills in with all the mud because it's still wet because it's been raining for so long here in Australia. Let me show you. All right, see so here, still wet, soaking, mud. You can see all my footprints. And down here, look, still wet. Look, just sinking in. So there's not much you can do when it's this wet, guys. You, all you can do is the best you can. And you know what? It's already looking 
a million times better than what it was. Another great start. Anyway, let's finish off. guys hope you enjoyed that again while not perfect a hell of a lot better than what it was you wouldn't have even known there was even a path here before i started but anyway don't forget we've got the backyard coming up i'm going to show you that now which is what you've been waiting for so check that uh, video out probably i don't know next three or four weeks but anyway in the meantime thanks for watching as usual and i'll see you on the next one